You know, I, uh, I have a big painting of Hitler, uh, Adolf Hitler. I have it, I, in my closet, I, I have a big walk-in closet. I, I have a painting of Adolf Hitler in there. And I, I sit at the table every day and I eat meat. I eat a lot of different meat there, right in front of him, right in, right in front of the painting. I'm not a Nazi, you know, but I, I don't think, I don't know if he really valued human life, you know, obviously, but I think he did generally, you know, like animals, care about animals. You know, he was a vegetarian, Hitler. He liked dogs, liked painting them. He, he did some animal rights stuff, I know. So what I do is I, I always cook up a bunch of meat, uh, just more than I even need, you know, and I just sit there in front of him, in front of the painting, uh, alone there. Uh, I put the chair uh, outside the closet. I can, you know, just barely get to the table, but obviously it'd look weird if I had a painting of Hitler out there. People wouldn't understand, but I sit there and I eat the meat, and I just stare at him while I eat the meat, right, in, right into his eyes. I, I eat the meat, and, and I just, I, I, I eat it all, and, and when I'm done, I put the, the ta you know, the plates on the table to the edge of the table, right in front of the painting, just the greasy plate, the plates, everything, and I just leave it sitting there for hours, so so that he has to look at it, you know, because I I know it upsets him, you know, to to think, and I I tell him, you know, I tell him, I talk to him, the painting, I tell him that, you know, uh, factory farming is bigger than it's ever been. Uh, there's all kinds of animals suffering now. You didn't win. You failed miserably. You failed. You know, all around the world, you failed. Uh, you know, he, he was apparently pretty big pals with, you know, Islamic states. Well, um, well, now there's more halal meat shops than ever. Uh, so the, the animals are suffering more than ever when they're being killed, when they're being slaughtered. You know, they, they hang them up and they drain the blood out. Uh, and, and I'm not a, not a terrible man, I'm not a hateful, evil man, but... <coughs> you know, I, I hate Nazis. I and I just know that. And you know, I think uh, certain cultures, like the Japanese, you know, people believe that they can uh, make offerings to spirits, right, uh, to to deceased people, right, some sort of shrine. And I do that too, but I do it uh, in the opposite way, you know, as a way to communicate, to, so he can see it and hear it. Um, if there is some sort of afterlife, see it and hear it, and and really suffer, you know, to to really suffer, knowing about uh, how the world is and and adding whatever I can. And you know, sometimes I <clears throat> sometimes I I think I I see the painting crying. I I see the eyes water, but. But every time I really look close to it after that, the, the painting's dry, you know, the paint hasn't run uh, on the eyes or anywhere, but sometimes I think I see it crying. So I think maybe I'm reaching him somehow, you know, maybe, maybe I'm doing good for the world, maybe I'm finally, you know, maybe they can, you know, pay for what they've done, maybe Hitler, you know, maybe I'm getting to him, I, I don't know. But other times I think maybe it's just the the spirits of the animals, right? Because I'm I'm eating so much more than I even need. I'm not even hungry. I just eat and eat more of it just to make him suffer till till it makes me sick and I keep eating it and I just leave it there. The the plates, the empty plates, the greasy, the bones on the plate, and sometimes I think it's the animal spirits maybe uh, interacting with me through the painting, right? Uh, maybe. It's them, because because I'm just I'm eating so much of it and I don't even need it, you know. And and sometimes you know I've had cuts on my hands on the top of my hands for a long time for months. I keep getting more cuts and they, my hands keep bleeding, you know. And I, I've had some even deep cuts, but I I didn't do them to myself and I uh, myself and, and I haven't I haven't cut them on anything. There's nothing I could have cut them on. I've tried using lotion, right? Even even strong lotion, you know. I've 
I've tried not washing them too much or using soap with lotion. I've tried having a bunch of vitamin C. I take vitamin C tablets every day now, but the cuts never quite go away. They just start to go away, but you can still kind of see them, and then there's just more, and my hands just keep bleeding. I I feel like it's the, the animal spirits maybe cutting my hands and scratching at me, you know, trying to get me to stop. But but I don't because I have to I have to stop I have to stop the Nazis. I have to Hitler could be it could be Hitler trying to stop me, I don't know. That may be some sort of uh bizarre dark magic I uh he's using, I don't know, but I can't give in to to the Nazis and socialist socialism, you know. <sighs> anyway, that's it. I hope uh I hope this has maybe inspired you to uh to do your bit to fight the Nazis, uh to fight this sort of socialist uh regime. Uh maybe it's in the real world or the afterlife or both really. We've gotta fight them. I hope it's inspired you. Okay.